What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lauren and I am a flight attendant here in the United States. Usually I'm pretty good about filming intros to my videos and I kind of forgot. So here we are. This is a couple days after a four day trip I just got off of and boy it was a trip. So if you would like to keep watching, let's get into the video. What's up guys? Um, we were about to fly to O'Hare and we are super delayed. Not only that, but we just canceled two of our four flights. So we're not sure what's gonna happen next, but we're just hanging out until then. Everyone say hi to Georgetta. Georgetta, Hello. welcome to the vlog. <laughs> All right, so they canceled the flight and we are now taking this plane to Washington, D.C., but we are taking it with no passengers so we can pick up the rest of the trip. So what happened is there is a lot of weather in the O'Hare Airport in Chicago, so we cannot fly there right now. So we are going to take this plane with no passengers to D.C. and then pick up the rest of the trip. So I'm not mad about it. This is like a great situation to be in, so stay tuned. All right guys, so we made it to DC, but we have really no idea what's gonna happen. The weather is not good in Chicago where we're supposed to go, so we're just hanging out. Me and Georgetta are just chilling. And we're not at the gate either, <laughs> so. Georgetta, what's the situation? The situation is, we haven't worked all day. <laughs> All of our flights canceled. Now we've just repoed two flights, ferried two flights. So uh, we are working. Yeah. What a job. <laughs> What's up, guys? I am so comfortable right now. I just got out of the shower. And they have robes, which is so nice. Um, but I will give you my room tour. I just took a like three hour nap and I might have just screwed myself for sleep tonight, but I will show you my hotel room. Bathroom. Closet. So I'm gonna get out of this robe and I will explain what the heck happened today. Um, you probably got bits and pieces from what I did film, but I'm going to sit down here in just a few minutes and actually explain what happened today. All right, so I need to explain what the heck happened today. So originally I was supposed to work four flights um, and that did not happen, as you could see. Um, so we get delayed in Indy 30 minutes and we're all thinking, you know, ATC, whatever, Chicago is Chicago. And then we all look at the radar and there's like massive storms moving through and they ended up canceling Indy to O'Hare and they also canceled O'Hare to DC. And so we got the word that we needed to take the plane from Indianapolis to Washington, D.C. so we can finish the rest of the trip. So that is a ferry flight without passengers. So we just needed to get the plane from one, one point to another. So we get to Washington, D.C. And they're like, oh, you know, Chicago's a mess. You guys can't even leave for five or six more hours. And so they parked us, not even at a gate, literally at, on this little parking spot next to a fire station, like way off in the airport. Um, and so I will enter the clip of us riding around in a fire truck. <laughs> uh, that was fun. So shout out to the DCA fire um, department. Thank you for showing us around. And yeah, that was super fun. That's never happened before. But anyways, we get back on the plane. We're just literally hanging out. I took like a 30 minute nap and they're like, 
all right dc to o'hare canceled and so we ended up ferrying another flight from dc to birmingham which is where we were supposed to end up originally after working four flights today so i did not have any passengers today literally not one did not deal with a single person today so it was a day and I just took a nap and I'm at this really really nice hotel as you could see in downtown Birmingham so this is a I should probably explain what's going on now so this is a four-day trip on day one of four tomorrow we have a LaGuardia overnight which is New York City and then the day after that we are in Cleveland for over 24 hours so I don't want to tell you my plans yet because yesterday could happen again and things can change so i will fill you in um as we go along but i'm gonna head to bed and i have a five o'clock van tomorrow and we go from birmingham to chicago fingers crossed and chicago to laguardia so i will check in in the morning What's up guys? I am in Chicago and we're about to head to LaGuardia. We just did a flight from Birmingham and everything went super well and now we go to New York City. So I think it's about a two hour flight or something like that. And uh, we're done and then we're gonna go into the city. My first officer and my flight attendant, uh, I think we're gonna go to Manhattan and I'm so excited. So, I will see you guys in just a little bit. My favorite part about each flight is I get to hit ice with this mallet and let out all my anger and aggression on the ice. Just kidding. <laughs> but it is kind of fun. What's up guys? We made it to New York City and we're about to go to Manhattan. I am literally so excited. Um, I don't have enough room in my purse. I have a really small purse. Um, I'm actually going to work on getting like a backpack or a bigger purse to take with me on trips. So I can bring my camera, but I am going to vlog on my phone. So I just don't feel comfortable taking my camera to downtown with me. But super excited and yeah, uh, this is my outfit in case any, any of you wanted to know what I'm wearing. So yeah, I will talk to you guys in just a little bit. almost five in the morning and it is day number three of the trip tonight we are in Cleveland for 26 hours like what the heck but um, we go from here to Cleveland Cleveland to Fort Myers and Fort Myers to Cleveland and then done for the day so I need coffee and then I'll be ready to go for the day so I will see you guys in just a little bit guys we got to talk about yesterday so yesterday I had planned on vlogging a little bit um, way more than I did but it turned out to be one of the craziest days that I've ever had on this job so right now I'm in Cleveland Ohio it is the next day at about 11 in the morning um, yesterday it was an absolute just disaster <laughs> um, so we originally had three legs planned and it was about seven hours of flying which isn't too bad like Everything was going smoothly and we land and the captain says, hey, crew scheduling reassigned us. We have to do two more flights. 
So that is a total of five flights and I have never been on five flights in my whole entire life. Um, thankfully the last flight was a deadhead, but the whole entire day, I didn't even have a chance to do anything other than board and deep plane an airplane. Like I literally had no time to eat, no time to check my phone or vlog or literally do anything. So that's what happened yesterday. And then we're on the deadhead. So this is flight number five out of five. And we about get stuck in Chicago because of weather. So we are on the tarmac for probably like, I'd say 45 minutes to an hour, which isn't that bad. But I was like so tired that all I did was just like hang out in my seat and like listen to music. So I really didn't care. But yesterday was super long. That's why I didn't vlog. Um, but last night um, I went out with my crew and they are so freaking awesome. One of the best crews ever. And now here I am today and it's go home day. This was a pretty long four day trip. Um, definitely got our money's worth uh, we flew a lot each day it wasn't like my five day where we had like a flight a day or two flights a day so this has definitely um, been quite the trip but at the same time it's been one of the best trips um, New York was literally amazing and um, yeah so I will try to check in with you guys later. Um, I have until 3 p.m. today. We go from Cleveland to Newark and Newark to Indy, so only two flights, and hopefully all goes well. Um, Newark can be kind of a pain, but I think I'm gonna head over to the mall, and I don't know what I'm gonna do today. Um, I have about four, three and a half hours, give or take, about three hours to do something, so. Yeah, I will check with you guys in just a little bit. What's up guys? I'm heading to the airport. It's actually an hour later. We were supposed to be there an hour ago, but our flight's already delayed. So, am I shocked? Not at all. So, here's hoping we can get to Newark and then work Newark to Indy and be done for the night. So, yeah, I will see you guys in just a little bit. What's up guys? I made it on the plane. As I said earlier, we're delayed. I think we're a couple hours delayed now, but it is 6.40 and we still have to go to Newark. And yeah, I will keep you guys updated. I just did my safety checks. Now I think we board in about five to 10 minutes. So uh, I hope this is the only delay and we can get right out of here and then go home to Indianapolis. So fingers crossed. I'll check in with you guys in just a little bit. I just have a feeling we're gonna be back in Indianapolis like super late tonight. Like I just, have that feeling or early in the morning yeah Newark is a nightmare and there's weather moving in right that right now so uh, I don't know what's gonna happen I have no idea so I'll keep you guys updated Georgetta what's the update the update is Lauren is so bored <laughs> but you gotta see her do this thing right now let's do this thing right now okay okay now Four hours of oh, delays. I'm losing my mind. I can't do it. I can't recreate it. <laughs> oh, yes, yeah, she can. All right, guys. So the last thing you saw was me in Cleveland, and weather was moving in, and I was unsure if we were going to get out or if flights were going to cancel. So we did make it out of Cleveland. However, when we landed in Newark, we landed in a severe thunderstorm. So you can imagine that landing. Um, so yeah, once we landed in Newark, we were on a ground stop, so the ramp was closed, meaning we were not able to be marshaled into our gate, bags could not be unloaded, so we were stuck on the tarmac for about 30 to 45 minutes. Then we deplaned, we reboarded, and headed to Indianapolis, and that flight got in at about 2 in the morning. So in aviation world, 2 a.m. means the next day. So it's not midnight, it's 2 a.m. So we did go into an extra day. So technically the four day trip turned into a five day trip. So this trip was just crazy all the way around, but I'm very glad I had such an awesome crew. Shout out to Georgetta for being in my vlog. She was such a great girl to work with and the pilots were so awesome so shout out to my crew during this trip 
it was actually insane but yeah that's this week's walk i hope you guys liked it make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and to subscribe to my youtube channel if you're new here and yeah stay tuned for my next vlog i have a couple of very exciting trips coming up including one to my extremely like number one absolutely favorite city in the united states so stay tuned for that vlog it will be coming in the next week or so so i will see you guys later